So let me talk you through Arkansas Traveler. Uh, Arkansas Traveler is going to have, like all fiddle tunes, an A part and a B part. And there's four phrases in the A part and four phrases in the B part. And what we're going to do is talk you through each part, uh, each phrase, one at a time. So let's get started with phrase one. And it's going to start off by doing a hammer-on on the first string, second fret. Uh, so open to two. I'm not showing you the left hand. I can talk you through the left hand. I just want you to watch the right hand. So again, first string open, hammer on to the second fret. Notice even when I'm doing that, I cock this fifth string. Then you're going to do a drop thumb. And for those of you who have not done a drop thumb, it's really not that difficult. We're going to break it down. You're going to hit the first string open and your thumb's going to drop down to that second string open. So let's do the hammer on again. First string, second fret, open to two. Okay, so from the beginning, hammer on, drop thumb, then your middle finger is going to fret the third string, second fret. You're going to play that note twice, then open twice. Then second string open, and you're just brushing down and picking off the fifth string. One more time, hammer on, open to two on the first string, drop thumb, Third string, second fret, third string, second fret, third string open, third string open, second string open. Don't worry about speed, but I would make sure that you have that first phrase memorized. All right, let's do the second phrase. And you're going to start with your middle finger of your left hand on the second string, second fret. So you're just picking that, uh, when I say picking, you're hitting downward with your nail. But second string, second fret, you can brush, pick. Then the first string, second fret, you can just move your finger over, move that middle finger over. So. And then you're going to do a hammer on again on the first string, open to two with the drop thumb just like we started. Then the third string, sec, uh, second fret, then third string open. So it's... Second string, second fret, first string, second fret, hammer on, drop thumb, third string, second fret, third string open. All right, let's put the first and second phrase together. Sorry. One more time. Your third phrase is identical to the first phrase. So we don't need to reteach that, you just need to play it. So from the beginning, first phrase, second phrase. phrase, and let's now do the fourth phrase. You're going to start on the third string open, but you're going to do a hammer on to the second fret. Then you're going to hit the second string open, 
second string open, third string open. So you have this so far. Third, so one more time, third string open to a second fret hammer on, second string open, second string open, third string open. Then you're going to reach to the fourth string, fourth fret with your ring finger. And you're going to play four, three, two, open. So the fourth string, you're just playing down your frets. Four, three, two, open. And I'm fretting that fourth fret with my ring finger, that third fret with my middle finger, the second fret with my pointer finger, then open. So again, here's your last phrase of part A. I'm going to talk you through that last phrase one last time. Starting on the third string, second fret, you're going to do a hammer on, second string open, second string open, third string open, fourth string, fourth fret with ring finger, three with middle, two, open. That's all on the fourth string. So from the very beginning, each phrase. First phrase, second phrase, third phrase, last phrase, So let's put that all together at a picked up speed. Again, don't worry about speed. I just want you to get the tune in your head. So that's part A. Let's move on to part B. And uh, part B is rather easy. You're going to start on the first string and you're going to put your ring finger on the fifth fret of the first string and stripping it down you're going to put your middle finger on the first string third fret and then you're going to put your index finger on the second fret of the first string and then open so five three two open that's all on the first string ring middle index open let's fill that in so as you're doing is you're doing you're holding the five pick brush pick three and you're just holding it And if you don't want to brush the strings, you can just hit the single string. So that's phrase one. Make sure you memorize that. Phrase two is uh, starting on the second string open, then the first string open, then you're going to do a hammer on on that first string open to two. And then leaving that two down, you're going to pick that first string again, and then the fifth string. So it's then first string open. So again, your second phrase, second string open, brush, first string, brush, hammer on on the first string to the second fret, leaving the two down, hit that first string again, and then the first string open. So here's your second phrase. Make sure you study that measure. Make sure you have that memorized. All right, let's put the first and second phrase together. Again, your third phrase is identical to the first, starting at five, three, oops, sorry, two, open. 
So from the beginning, let's do all three fr uh, phrases, starting at five. Your last phrase is very similar to the last phrase of part A. You're going to play the second string open, the third string at the second fret with your index, third string open, fourth fret at the fourth string with your ring. So it's just four notes, open on the second, second fret on the third, third string open, fourth string at the fourth fret with your ring, and then three, two, O. Oh. And again, that's ring, middle, index, open. Here's part B, slow. So let me play part B through one time at a fast speed. So I hope you enjoyed that and I uh, hope you learned from that. Uh, I do give Skype lessons and I give FaceTime lessons and there's contact information for that with this video. But I hope you enjoyed that and I hope that was a help. Thanks so much and look forward to seeing you.